What up, peeps? It's your girl, Dosh. Come back to Frill Takes. Well, it's that time of you guys. It's Horror Short Time, and this one is titled Facelift. So <laughs> already I'm truly intrigued, but I need to know, but is it scary though? Let's go and jump into it. I'll say the rest of my thoughts at the end, you guys. <laughs> What in the world? Hmm. Hey, this is Paul. I'm not near the phone right now, but leave a message. Paul, I know you're in Belize with that 24-year-old slut. I found the damn itinerary. Oh, wow. People are just leaving face facelift masks on the doorstep. Okay. Do you want to erase all those hideous lines and wrinkles on your face and look young, beautiful, and confident again? Then this device is for you. You just have to follow three important rules. First, do not, under any circumstance, use this mask more than two times. Second, after you're done using it, pass it on to somebody else who needs it immediately. Don't keep it. Oh. And third, do all this without telling a single soul. This is our little secret. Uh -huh. Congratulations. You're going to get your life back again. <laughs> Cosmetic companies. You have one new message. Hey, yes, it's your nagging sister again. Just wanted to check in. I know you hate me being intrusive, but I haven't heard from you in a while, so I'm just a little concerned. Call me back, okay? Bye. Mm-hmm. It's just a matter of time. What am I thinking? <laughs> you wanna... <laughs> Buddy? She heard the key word, you can be young again. <laughs> Mm 
she getting happy. She won't keep using it. If you're hesitant, that should be like a no, but face looking too good. She can't help herself. <laughs> Do not, under any circumstance, use this mask more than two times. Uh -huh. After you're done using it, pass it on to somebody else who needs it immediately. Don't keep it. Those are the directions. You could be young again. Oh, girl. Sweetie. What in the world? <laughs> you want to look even younger, don't you? Well... Your wish is granted. Use the mask a third time, and you can look like me. But the instructions said that I could only use the mask two times, and then I had to give it to somebody else. Yeah, and so you did. Yes, but you didn't give it away immediately, exactly. did you? You kept it for yourself. So now you have no choice. You have to use it a third time. Or else? Or else you'll turn into an old woman with features so hideous and disgusting that people will wretch at the very sight of you. The mask can give, but it can also strip it all away. <laughs> Get that thing and thing out my house. <sighs> Is this my <laughs> Oh. Ooh. Uh, uh, uh. 
get that thing out your house, girl. <laughs> Wake up. There you go. Get it out the house. Mess up her face even more. This is the only way to that you're not telling me clearly it's worked wonders <laughs> where are you right now oh i'm just swinging by essie's she asked me to drop off some legal documents for the house oh okay well tell her to return my calls i've been trying to get in touch with her for over a week okay hold on a sec mom i'm just about to enter the house Don't tell me that was her. you guys i really did enjoy this horror short first off okay i felt for her because of course she's clearly dealing with some relationship issues and all that but of course you see the gift of the um this you know product left on her doorstep unbeknownst to her from who and she brings it in and you read the directions and you don't follow the directions. <laughs> she comes very consumed with her overall appearance that after the two times that should have been it and done that. But like they say, a lot of times in certain movies, when they don't follow it, of course it progresses the storyline, but then it's just like, okay, all of a sudden we want to act like we don't don't want to deal with the ramifications of our actions in those um certain circumstances. And with her having that dream, you know, seeing what could happen to her face, her hands, you know, her overall skin, then going ahead and putting it back on. I'm like, the damage was done. Your face is done. 
And then I'm assuming definitely erupted, but definitely something spiritual, you know, evil, you know, entity within the face mask. Cause I'm trying to think, I'm like the one before that, which is now you see was her sister wanted to cheer her up and, you know, make her feel a little bit better with, you know, the situation happening at home with her never thinking. So to know that her, her daughter went over there to see, you know, her aunt and catches her. She's thinking about, and to see the reveal it was her that did that think she was doing a good deed, you know, to cheer her up, which she might in some ways think, you know, it cost her death. Oh my gosh. Who did you get this face mask from? Like when you start hearing voices talking to you, saying your name, that right would have like, nah, I'm not even going to start. Let me, if I heard anything like that out of my house, but ain't nobody going through all these stuff or whatever. If my face is, it is what it is. <laughs> I'm not trying to mess with my face in any capacity like that. But you know, some people, the temptation is more, it's real. It's real out here. So, but yes, this was really good. Definitely some creepy factors within it, you know, and definitely the ending. So with that said, comment below, you guys, let me know what you think. And with that next, I will see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.